All right, let's do this. Let's uh, let's get to some quick tips, shall we? Indeed. Ben Ben shares one. He says, my partner wanted to share her password to log into a particular service using my Mac, where I was logged into my user instead of hers. Instead of manually dictating or transcribing from her device with the stored password to mine, I thought, wait, we can use live text. I captured the text string using my iPhone camera, copied it, and then pasted it on my Mac. So easy. I like it. This is not flawless. I have tried this after I got Ben's email. I was like, this is amazing. And I was doing something last night, which we will talk about later in the show as well, that required copying something similar to a password uh, the same way. And it it like it turned uh, it was weird. It like it turned a lowercase O into a capital O and there was something. Oh, and a G into a Q or vice versa. But there were there were two things that were wrong. And it was like, thankfully, we weren't doing passwords so we could see what we were pasting in on on both sides. And it was like, wait, 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 let's compare. Ah, this is a problem. It's like, can you copy that and text it to me instead? Which is another way of doing it. Uh, Slightly, slightly less secure because you're. Yeah, well, if you're using iMessage, it's end-to-end encrypted. But this is a good thing. It it is worth trying. It it just you know it's not a flawless technology, but I I love this idea. It's fantastic. So, is good. 